But you, you basically come in and either rent a flat a flat bay for ten dollars an hour, um, and you get you know we have all the tools, or you rent a lift for twenty dollars an hour, and and you work on your own car. You do your own brakes, your own oil, your own whatever. The knowledge to do the basic things, oil changes and brakes, and just maintaining your fluid levels and knowing what's under the hood of your car. Give me an hour and a half, and you'll know everything you need to know. I mean, it really is that easy. If you can make a pot of coffee, you can change your oil and, and your brake pads. I promise. <laughs> there are more steps to making a pot of coffee, and I'm not even joking. It's that easy. My first car was back in the UK. was a type of Volvo they don't sell here. Um, it was fantastic. You know, it was just a piece of rubbish. It really was an awful car, but I absolutely loved it. You know, wheel, rear wheel drive with a stick, which was a lot of fun to play around with on the wet roads in England. And, uh, you know, it's just that sense of freedom. So The idea came from me just wanting to use a place like this, basically. Um, it just didn't make any sense that, that my only option was to struggle to do something on my car in my garage at home and spend goodness knows how many hundreds of dollars, if not thousands, on tools and everything to be able to do it, or take it to someone who I don't know, don't necessarily trust, who's going to overcharge me for things that I don't even know if they need replacing, you know, or not. Um, and for those to be the only two options seemed a little silly to me. So came up with the one in the middle, basically.